The Zionist war machine raided Gaza's Al Shifa hospital for a second day in a row after besieging it for six consecutive days, claiming that Hamas was using the hospital as a command center and a military post, saying the raid has helped it find evidence to back up its assertion. But more than 24 hours after the raid, the army failed to show any evidence of its claims in a crystal clear intelligence failure to justify random attacks. Neither Hamas-run tunnels nor military command center under the hospital were found. Even Zionist media confessed the failure, arousing unprecedented local and international condemnations. After 20 hours of their entry to Al Shifa Hospital, they exit with this week's story. It is obvious that they got with them a group of weapons and consider it to be evidence that justify their claims. But truly, it was inconsistent and evidence that all the occupation stories are based on lies and no one truly believes it. The stage theater to cover up lies and distorted information didn't succeed in deceiving anyone. On the contrary, it only ridiculed the image of the occupation. The Zionist regime has not only failed in proving its lies in Shaden, but hasn't achieved any of its objectives, including eliminating Hamas, freeing its hostages, and displacing the Palestinians to neighboring countries. Since the beginning of the war, the occupation is stuck in its own random and discriminate plans to achieve its aims, at the expense of tens of thousands of innocent people's lives. But the occupation has suffered setbacks on the military, economic, political, social and internal fronts over the past few weeks, demonstrating the breakdown of its narrative.